Golden Week lunch, downtown Osaka area. Carbonara. Mm. Mm. Cheesy rice and shrimp. I can't, mine's overcooking it. It's melting the shit out of it already. Cheese pull up. Oh. Mm. Look how busy it is today. Yep. Golden week in full force now. Oh, look at that ass down there. <laughs> yeah, twelve more. <laughs> At this train station in Osaka, they have a full on like Lego brick museum. Oh, yeah, coming. Oh yeah? Oh, the train station. Mm -hmm. cool. Wow, is that a uh, castle? Saga castle? Yeah. Classy. Yeah. This is sick. Yeah. Oh. It's just inside the train station here. <laughs> Today we are at Central Circuit for a Zero Fighter track day. Zero Fighter and Dogfight Pro track day. Not a very big event, it's pretty small. It's the Golden Week though, so you always get people coming out here for these events. And uh, there's some cool cars here and some cars that I've actually never seen before. Which is pretty cool. I already spotted like a couple cars that like, I have never been aware of their existence. So it'll be cool to see some new cars today and uh, a nice chill vibe here at Central Circuit all the time. So let's check it out. Joe from across is EG6, and there's this EG9 Ferio that we always see. <laughs> Just didn't have one. <laughs> this Ikigami's EF9. One of my favorites from out here. 
with the Jax livery and these new Inky PF06 wheels. I wasn't that big of a fan of them on uh, the GR in that sizing in 18s, but they look great in 15s. It's like perfect for like a for a Honda or anything that runs typically 15 or 16 inch wheels. It's a good look. It has a good hub face on it, spoke design. I mean, you can't go wrong with a six spoke wheel. Just put a fat tire on it, it looks good. Warp Racing EF9 here. <laughs> the slow pan to just like cruising. <laughs> Zero fighter cars here. for aerodynamics is just always broken on these cars. <laughs>
Yeah, nice. <laughs> the tuning father KKR EG6. Many a father has tuned. E16A. KEW built engine. Kanagawa engine works. No, brand new engine though. Mm -hmm. Toyota ITB. The oh, the Motec too? Mm -hmm. nice. Cam gears. Yeah, I think so. Pretty sure. Oh, you can see the date when it was built right there. <laughs> it is a fresh engine. <laughs> huh? Oh no, the, the date of the engine. <laughs> July 2022. Huh. I think it's Naoki Tanaka, I think his name is. From Domination. Ah, full cage. Fuel cell. Okay. Oh, yeah. Motec M84. Cool custom dash set up here. old fuel filler area. They don't use it anymore, but it's definitely still here because you can't just replace this section. Yeah. Wow, it's like fully cut out. Right. Seems to be a little bit of an oil leak right now. This EG is nice too. From Grace? can see in this one. Hmm. There's a original Wed Sport Alteza race car here. It looks like it's privately owned now maybe? And like <laughs> decommissioned? Still has delivery and everything. Obviously, still has the Wed Sport TCO 5s on there. Yeah, no arrow. It's probably like an endurance race car, I think. Wow, custom cluster. Probably has a sticky dash, too. Only IS guys know about that. Haro SPA? I think. Full bolt in cage. So cool to see this thing. Probably <laughs> a beams engine in there. It's rad. You just never know what you're gonna see in Japan at the track or in a parking lot or anywhere. It's like a true wet sports racing car.
simple B16A setup under here. There's something going on right now where they're pulling a plug and checking depth inside for some reason. I don't know what's going on, but... That's how you check? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. I guess that's how you figure out if it's a B16A or not. <laughs> They're over here trying to figure out why Ikigami is so fast compared to the other EFs here. So you just check how far down it goes? Destroyed. 
for supports damage, but nothing too crazy. The EK was way worse. This one is actually a pretty simple fix. Just gotta change the core support, and that's about it. The engine's good, everything else is good. The hood's not so great, but... This one's not too bad. I think it hit a tire, tire barrier wall or something. It went off at some point, I hit the wall and got cushioned.